Good morning, babies. What are you doing up so early? Oh, you're practicing for the school talent show? All right, then. Let's see what you can do. Nice juggling, baby Tom. Ooh, didn't know you were such a great musician, baby Amber. Let's sing a song, baby Pickle. Uh-oh, I don't hear anything. What's wrong? Oh, I see. She's supposed to sing, but she's lost her voice. That's terrible. Great idea, baby Amber. Your mom will know how to make baby Pickle feel better. Let's go see her. Hi there, Amber. Mm. Baby Pickle lost her voice, and she needs it back for the talent show. Can you see her? Mm. Oh, good. She's in the waiting room with Baby Amber and Baby Tom. Has your voice come back yet, Baby Pickle? Come on, Amber will take care of you in the exam room. We'll be right back, Baby Tom. What's the diagnosis, Amber? Don't be frightened, Baby Pickle. <laughs> no, Baby Amber, it's not a melted popsicle. You're silly. It's so your mom can look in Baby Pickle's throat to see what's wrong. Okay, now just open wide and say, ah. Is it laryngitis, Amber? Ah, I see. So what is the treatment? Good idea. Some medicine for the pain will help. You're very good about taking your medicine, Baby Pickle. I'm impressed. Is that it, Amber? Oh, you have one more treatment? Let's see what it is. Strong hot tea with lemon. That's very clever of you, Amber. Oh, you don't like tea very much, Baby Pickle? Hmm. Aha, good thinking, Baby Amber. How sweet of you. Sweet as sugar. So, Baby Pickle, are you ready to head home? You'll need some rest before the show. I sure hope your voice comes back in time. Don't forget to grab a treat before you go. I hope that cheers you up a bit. Oh, the show has already started. Big crowd. Look at Baby Tom go. Are you ready, Baby Pickle? How's your voice? Wonderful! Baby Pickle is a lovely singer. Great job today, Amber. And thanks for your help too, Baby Amber. See you next time, friends. Hi, Baby Frank. What are you doing? <laughs> Playing a game of marbles? <laughs> You're not supposed to eat your marbles, Baby Frank. <laughs> are you sure it's your gumball? <laughs> okay, if you say so. Oh, baby Frank, it wasn't a gumball, right? Are you okay, baby Frank? You have a sore throat?
That's not good. You need to go to the hospital and see Amber. Here comes your dad. He can take you to Amber. Hmm. Hi, Amber. Baby Frank has a sore throat. Mm -hmm. Can you help? Mm -hmm. Baby Frank, Amber is ready for you. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, Baby Frank. You'll be okay. Baby Amber, can you get your mom a stethoscope? She needs to check baby Frank's organs. Thanks, baby Amber. Let's see if your organs are okay, baby Frank. Great, everything is normal. The salt water will help your swollen throat, Baby Frank. That's not how you examine Frank's throat, Baby Amber. <laughs> this would never happen with a cupcake, Baby Frank. What's that, Amber? Throat spray? That's to help soothe baby Frank's throat. That's sweet, baby Amber, but we'll save the candy bar for later. Open wide, Frank. It's okay, baby Frank. The spray won't hurt. Tastes good, doesn't it? And I bet you feel better, too. And baby Amber made you hungry? How about some old-fashioned chicken soup? Does that sound good, baby Frank? Look, baby Frank. Soup is also a sore throat soother. Amber, you take such good care of your patients. And you too, baby Amber. Yes, thank you, Amber, for helping baby Frank's throat. That's right, baby Frank. Now you can go and choose a candy from the giant candy machine. That's a candy marble on the top of your cupcake, baby Frank. It's okay to eat that. It's not a real marble. <laughs> See you next time, friends. Hey, baby Ben. Relaxing after a hard day at school? I wouldn't eat that if I were you, Ben. Food on the ground might have germs on it. That was very silly, Ben. You might be ill. You do feel ill? We'd better go see Amber the ambulance to see if she can make you feel better. Ben ate something off the floor, and now he feels sick. 
You're right, Amber. You should never eat food you find on the floor. <coughs> what can you do to make Ben feel better? <coughs> you need to make a diagnosis first. Hey, baby Amber. Your mother was talking to you. It's rude to ignore her. She's playing a new video game? That sounds like fun, but you still have to listen to your mother when she's talking. Baby Amber, can you get a thermometer? You're going to check his temperature? Wow, you do have a temperature. That's right. Eating old dirty pizza probably gave you food poisoning. Now you have a temperature. Haha, <laughs> 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 that got your attention. Can you get a wet towel to cool Ben down? I think that's a bad idea. You should play on the computer after you've finished helping your mother. Feel better, Ben? Amber is going to give you some medicine now, Ben. Baby Amber, can you get some medicine for Ben? Take this medicine after you eat your next meal. It should make you feel better. Is that everything, Amber? Thanks for making Ben feel better. Ben can take a candy from the machine on the way out. Bye-bye, Amber. Bye-bye, baby Amber. You're not sure about eating the candy? It's okay. This food hasn't been on the floor, so it's safe to eat. Hey, Ben. Feeling better? That's great. Don't eat that, Ben. Eating food off the floor made you sick before. You're not going to eat it? That's smart, Ben. Now nobody can eat it. Bye-bye, Ben. See you later, everyone. Hey, Dane. What are you up to today? Going to knock down that wall? <laughs> Careful, it's very high. <laughs> well done, Dane. Hey, what's wrong? Ouch, that lump looks painful. What happened? You got hit by a brick? Oh dear, we'd better get you to the hospital. Amber will know what to do. 
Hey, Amber, Dane got hit on the head while he was working at the construction site. Mm -hmm. He's on the way here now. Can you help? Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, oh, oh. Amber says you can go home now, Charlie. Hey, Dane, here's Amber to take a look at your injury. Go ahead and follow Amber into the examination room. First of all, Amber needs to make sure you're strong and healthy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Stick out your tongue, Dane. Mm. What do you need, Amber? Oh, oh, oh. A tongue depressor? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Baby Amber, could you fetch one? Antibacterial gel will help keep your injury clean. What's next, Amber? Dane needs a Band-Aid? You can find one, Baby Amber? Well, okay. Oh dear, Baby Amber, you're covered with sticky band-aids. There you go, Dane. You'll feel better in no time. Great teamwork, guys. You'd better get back to the construction site. Be careful, Dane. No more accidents. See you soon. Hi, Matt. You sure have a tough task getting these cars to drive properly. Uh -huh. Look, there's uh -huh. Edgar the Excavator. Mm -hmm. That's so nice of you, Edgar. Matt, Edgar uh -huh. wonders if he should take over for a while so that you can get rest. That's a good question, Matt. You know how to direct traffic, Edgar? Wow, Edgar, this is your chance to prove you can do this. Whoa, break, guys. Oh, no. Are you okay, Pickle? Oh. <laughs> Phew! What a relief. Good thing nothing worse happened. <gasps> oh no! Edgar, are you okay? Mm. Then you'd better go see Amber at the hospital. She can help you. Oh. 
Hi, Amber. Hi, Hello. baby Amber. It looks like you have a new patient. Edgar the excavator had an accident while directing traffic and needs your help. Okay, Edgar. First of all, we have to do something about that headache. There. Open your mouth, Edgar. There. You'll feel better in just a little while. What more can Amber and Baby Amber do for you? Right. Pickle hit your bucket when she lost control. Amber, do you have a solution? There, Edgar. Don't use the bucket for the next few days, and you will be just fine again. Oh, I didn't see that until now. That's a nasty scratch you've got there. But I'm sure Amber can help you with it. Edgar, Amber is going to clean your wound and put a plaster on it. Don't worry, it won't hurt. <laughs> is it cold, Edgar? But it doesn't hurt, does it? That's good. There. Does it feel better, Edgar? Yes, Baby Amber? Do you have something for Edgar? Exciting! <laughs> Edgar, you have got a present from Baby Amber. It's to prevent more head damage from falling things. Looking good, Edgar. I think it's time to go back to Matt and tell him that you're okay. Yeah! Hoo -hoo. Thank you so much, Amber and Baby Amber. Soon, Edgar mm -hmm. can go back to his normal work. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. See you next time. Hey, guys. Follow us in our big adventures by clicking more videos. Download our app to play with your favorite friends. Thanks for riding with us. Hope you liked our video. Click here to subscribe and join the Car City family. See you on the road.